About some people it can be said, it is not a man who chooses the profession, but the profession chooses the man. Chef Arto Kovyazin is a Russian man who left the country to learn excellent culinary knowledge and experience in London. He now represents Britain in cuisine festivals and competitions all around the world. The International Kremlin Cup, which is a member of the World Association of Chefs Society, took place in Moscow from the 30th September until the 3rd of October 2009. It is a large-scale event held each year. Being back to the mother of land is a good reason for Arthur to recall his first steps in the profession. The day when we watch masterpieces he creates in the kitchen, it's so difficult to believe that years ago his culinary way started in Tartazan, Russia, when every day Arthur was coming home from his first restaurant job almost in tears. His fingers cut and pans burn. He could hardly believe that cooking would be the work of his life. My third job in Russia, uh, it's uh, a restaurant uh, Golden Bear. A long, long, long time ago, it's like uh, 10 years ago. I'm not sure, and sometimes I send it my, it's my fish or meat, and uh, it's raw, and uh, chips, uh, I was in a drop, in a drop in the floor, I have to get it in the floor and I put it in a plate and send it, and salt it. Um, yeah, it's so, so funny. My head chef, it saved me, uh, said me, you need alpha, uh, so you need more study, you need more teacher of the cookery. Thinking about, yes, uh, next I got uh, in, uh, in London. Now Arta works as a chef at the Sanctum Hotel in Soho, London. Prior to this, Arta has many years of experience in London, where he has worked at Frankie's Restaurant, the Criterion Grill, and Gordon Ramsay's Maze. Gordon Ramsay is one of the most famous chefs in the world and owns a chain of restaurants in Europe and the United States. We asked Arta, would you like to be back in Russia? And he answered quite quickly, as to live my life, yes, but to live my life as a cook, no. I can't, in a, uh, I can't in a eat because uh, I'm so hungry. Just thinking about in a, a lot of, lot of in a Russian people are thinking about this first. And England and Great Britain and people come in and uh, and restaurant thinking about in a, in a, and the chefs and the barman. But being a chef is more than simply working in a restaurant's busy narrow kitchen. It is the search for perfection in every gesture that leads to the perfection in taste and shape. And this search is endless. Competitions are the break in everyday work routines, where chefs can improve their skills and show magical culinary creations. The moment when people around can realise that cooking is an art. Uh, I don't understand because a lot of the chefs is so boring in the cooking, 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 cooking on your place. And I prefer on a, on a traveling in a different country and I try to cook and, uh, and try my best. So, Over 350 participants gathered in the Moscow Cuisine Festival. Chefs from Italy, Germany, Britain, Turkey, Russia, Latvia, Lithuania, Estonia, Ukraine, Malta, China, South Korea and other countries trying their skills in 27 classes. The judges, famous experts from the World Association of Chef Society, from France, Germany, Britain, Turkey and Russia, are sure to be hard taskmasters. The British one is make some very modern, some molecular kitchen. If you see in the publicum, everybody is interested what is going on there. Everybody is interested what are he doing new things over there. Uh, our colleague from London это человек, который привез новые блюда для нас на нашу выставку, очень оригинальные, потому что на самом деле э, ведь это одно название – оригинальное рыбное блюдо. Вот по сравнению с рядом стоящими э, своими коллегами, это было блюдо на самом деле оригинальным. I get it and so stress because I have 30 minutes, I don't have sauce, I don't have any oil, so I will see tomorrow. Arta won silver in the original fish dish and bronze in modern meat. In first place was a chef from Estonia. It's not me just the best because now it's coming uh, on the Moscow a lot of a lot of uh, chefs and uh, it's a different country and uh, all in uh, Europe and uh, I want to say everybody chefs is very very good very very perfect. Chefs return to their places of work with gold, silver and bronze medals hanging on their white chef's uniform. 
next day I will be come back at my job again and I wake up at 7 o'clock and come back at home and at 1 o'clock in the evening and save my life. And in Arthur's case we can say it is not the chef who finds the country but the country who finds the chef.